there guys, this is Sarah with Tour Reviews for You. I am so excited because I was just sent this brand new Yummy Nummy set. They're called Teeny Cine Rolls and in this set you make little tiny cinnamon rolls. Yum! The back of the box describes them as heavenly cinnamon rolls with whipped cream icing. Thank you very much to Flip Toys for sending this out for me to taste test before they hit the stores. So inside the kit, they give you a plastic tray, a packet of cinnamon roll dough mix, a packet of icing mix, a packet of cinnamon sugar mix, a plate, a knife, a spoon, a scoop, and of course some instructions on how to make your cinnamon rolls. In addition, you're also going to need some water, some scissors, and a microwave. So let's get started. First, I'm going to cut the center of the plastic tray right down the middle. I'm going to open up the dough mix and pour in seven scoops of the round scoop into tray number one. Now using the square scoop, I'm going to pour in four scoops of water. Give the mixture a little mixy mixy and here's a few mixy mixy shout outs for you guys. Today's mixy mixy goes out to Francis Appia, hopefully I'm saying that right, Bella Delker, Elizabeth Kearns, Casey Goodwin, Mia Young, Victoria Chuck, Jana Akil, Shopkins 300, and to Siri. 2424. Thank you guys so much for watching. Now I'm going to pour all of my batter into tray number two. Make sure to cover the bottom of the tray evenly because this is going to be the base for your cinnamon rolls. Once that you're satisfied with how the bottom looks, you're going to put this in the microwave anywhere from 15 to 20 seconds. I think I'm going to run mine for 17. While I'm waiting for my pan to cool down, I'm going to make the cinnamon sugar mix. I have the packet here of cinnamon sugar. In tray number three, I'm going to pour in two round scoops of the cinnamon sugar and a half square scoop of water. Give this a little mixy mixy. And I believe our dough mixture is cool enough. So now using the guides that are on the back of the plastic tray, I'm going to cut this into three equal pieces. Let's see if I can carefully separate the pieces. This one's fighting me. Oh, oh, whoops! Oh no, I've broken in a couple pieces. Hmm, I'll have to make this work somehow. Now it's time to form our cinnamon rolls, so I'll just take one piece at a time, cover it in delicious cinnamon sugar, and roll it to make that cute little cinnamon roll shape. It came out so cute! It looks just like a real one! I did the exact same thing with the other two strips.
So far so good, let's move on to the icing. Here is my last packet, my icing mix packet, and I'm going to pour, using my round scoop, three scoops of icing powder. And then one half square scoop of water into the very last tray. Give this a little mixy mixy, and I was actually quite surprised to see that this looked like real cinnamon roll icing. I'll just add a little dollop of icing to each of my three cinnamon rolls. Wow, these look delicious and they really smell delicious too. All right guys, I'm gonna try this now in front of you so you can watch my reaction to see honestly how I feel about these teeny city buns. So let's give them a shot. Mmm. It's so funny. The icing on top tastes exactly like it does on a regular sized cinnamon roll. It's so good. Now guys, I do want to tell you that this is not going to be exactly like a store bought or a cinnamon roll. It's a little bit doughier. Definitely not as sweet. I have to place this. The cupcakes are still my favorite, but this would be a close second. Out of all my favorite yummy nummies so far, cinnamon roll ones, definitely my second pick. Thank you again to Blip Toys for sending out these brand new yummy nummies for me to taste test. They should be hitting Toys R Us, Walmart, and Target pretty soon, so if you want to try them out, be sure to check on those stores. They'll be coming shortly. Thank you guys so very, very much for watching. We'll see you in the next video.